Hi. Um, right. So, the big news is I've been um, I've been suspended by Twitter, and I've got I've got printouts here of some things that people have have been saying about me over the last couple of weeks, and they suspended me from Twitter, but actually. I haven't done anything wrong. It says here, Hello, your account has been suspended and we will and will not be restored because it was found to be violating the Twitter terms of service, specifically the Twitter rules against participating in targeted abuse. In order to ensure people feel safe expressing diverse opinions and beliefs on our platform, we do not tolerate abusive behaviour. This includes behaviour that harasses, intimidates, or uses fear to silence someone else's voice. Well, that's what they were doing to me, and I complained repeatedly about the ringleader and also his friends um, doing all those things to me, and they Twitter did absolutely nothing, and in the end, they suspended me. So, I mean, this is just wrong, you know. This is crazy and um, I've got my own ideas as to why they suspended me because it was easy for them basically I mean after I made the video last time um, I got threats from this guy and he actually came onto my um, YouTube um, page as well onto my YouTube comments and um, he sent a lot of threats towards me or he sent a few threats. Um, and he's put this on Twitter. Yeah, it's at it again. Made that video about me, didn't it? That's a bell end it is. Ha ha, I was prepared to leave it, but they carried on. They're not going to like the next thing that happens. They were warned. Now, is that not a threat? Sounds pretty much like a threat to me. And it's not, the threats aren't coming from me, they're coming from him and his friends. And basically a lot of the insults I've had on here fall into three, four different categories. They're either transphobic, they're either misogynistic, they're either body shaming, particularly about my teeth, or other aspects of me that they don't feel are feminine. Um, they're either slut shaming, a lot of them are slut shaming, or they're either accusing me of being a sex offender, which is absolute rubbish. But it's very hurtful and damaging rubbish. <clears throat> I mean, they've been putting mock-ups mock -ups of my appearance as well. They've been taking my photograph, making fun of my teeth. <clears throat> Katie, please, can I fuck you? Excuse my French. Perhaps she's popped off for a shave. Pedo. Confirmation. As I have always said that he is a raging nonce. And that's me that you're referring to. I am not a, I'm not a pedophile. He just keeps on and on and on. Swamp donkey, bush pig, which I believe are misogynistic names for women that they don't like. I have wondered why I've not been able to sleep lately, and my mental health has been in bits. I am blaming having to look at that, i.e. me posted my video on his um, Twitter account. Again, I had him blocked and um, so he, he's actually the one who's been um, harassing me and each time he's made a, a, a false accusation against me, I put it onto my I put it onto my Twitter account. I tweeted you know to say that it wasn't true and that's how they got this targeted abuse thing from. Each time I've done that, he's picked up on, on it. Each time I've spoken out, you know? 
Calm down and look into Katie's abusive history towards people's kids. There is no abusive history towards people's kids. This is absolute rubbish. And it's just disgusting. And he calls me it and the thing right the way throughout. You know, this is just really upsetting. But Twitter have absolute they're on Twitter have come down on their side. I don't understand. Have you still got that contact at Twitter? Makes you wonder, doesn't it, whether they have got a contact at Twitter who gave them all my personal details. <clears throat> Perhaps may, maybe more people abused by Katie, inverted commas, will come forward. I haven't abused anybody. This is just awful. You know, it's just full of absolute, every single reply, every single, every single tweet, right? It's just like an attack on the way I look, just trying to, um, slander me. Dead naming me here. Hello, David. As you are aware, you have been exposed as a paedophile supporter and are continuing to spread lies in order to get people to join your non cult. See you in Cardiff. Well, I'm not a paedophile supporter. I don't, certainly not a cult leader. I mean, a few people stuck up for me on here, so, you know. I mean, other people could see what was going on as well. And Yeah, I had an email about Katie last night. Turns out it and nonces are very close friends. It explains the hatred towards me and my followers. This is just so wrong. There's sexually explicit ones as well about me. The guy here who's been picking on me says, sat there wanking over my replies, ain't it? Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, you bet in your dreams, mate. Here, Katie, Kev, hope you like my profile picture. It's cosy, and I'm 70 to 80% masturbating to it tonight. Pathetic. You are a perverted man wearing dressing gowns from the 1800s. You dress like people who take my village away for slaves. Can I just add, whatever the fuck it is, it's damn ugly. Probably switch in sex, see if it get laid as a different gender. Fuck, ain't gonna work though, looks like a bulldog licking piss off a nettle. And the guy who's the ringleader is laughing, he's saying, this has ruined me. Ha ha, eh? This is just so wrong, yet Twitter is saying that I'm the one who's been harassing, bullying and intimidating. This is so wrong. Who the fuck would pay you for sex? Well, I'm not asking for sex. Listen, donkey from Shrek. If you're going to lie and post falsehoods, I shall do the same. Is that what you want, piano gob? Shut up, you absolute fruitcake. I'm clearly a raging sexual deviant. Stop body shaming her because she's got a cock. I never knew taking hormones was bad for your teeth. Yet another problem these poor people have to overcome. That's not a woman. It looks like she has a mouthful of licorice or chewing tobacco. It's straight up scary. I'd rather fuck a plug socket attached directly to the national grid than go anywhere near that failure. 
She seems like a bit of tuna canoe to me, and that's being polite. Your model, Rose. So yeah, so I can't really see why Twitter is saying that I'm the one who's doing the intimidation and harassment. And what I think it is really is the fact that this guy has 60,000 plus followers and it was easier to um, suspend me than to uh, suspend him, basically. So Twitter, for all your um, fine words about supporting women, about being against cyberbullying and sexual harassment and all that Me Too stuff, for all your fine words about supporting the trans community, cracking down on transphobic harassment, etc., and, you know, being pro-LGBT, you know, in reality, that's just not the case because you will just side with whoever is the most popular, even if they're a raging transphobe, homophobe or misogynist. So, and I mean, Twitter, because they got my details so easily and whoever, how they got my details from Twitter, I don't know because those are supposed to be private. Who, you know, that just shows that Twitter is not a safe place for women, you know, or trans people, or probably not for anybody really. So yeah, so that's why I'm credited with Twitter. And uh, that's where this draws to a close. So bye.